hi everyone and welcome in the previous video we have covered that how we can publish some random values from our arduino to our arduino opc da server and we can read those value in our one of the opc da client okay in this video we are going to use the same architecture but in this video our arduino will publish temperature and humidity data from our dht11 sensor to our um, arduino opc server and then with the metric on opc explorer software we are going to read those data so i have prepared the arduino core so our arduino core is here okay i have created this two function temperature and humidity to publish those values and i have created two tag about temperature and humidity so we will upload this code to our arduino and then after with the help of metric and opc explorer we are going to read temperature and humidity value from our arduino so let me upload this code to my arduino so code is compiling we have to press the reset button when it starts uploading okay so i have pressed the reset button and my code is uploading and our code is done now as per this diagram we have completed the uh, work for our arduino to upload the code in the arduino and we have already made the connection for dht11 sensor with our arduino now we have to configure our arduino opc da server so we will open our folder and we will start our arduino opc da server so you can see here our arduino opc da server is up and running okay now we will minimize this one and uh, you can see here our arduino opc da server is up and running and waiting for client now we are opening metric and opc explorer to connect with this arduino opc da server and we will read humidity and temperature data in our metric and opc da explorer so metric and opc explorer let me open this one okay so you can see here in my local system i have two server metric and opc server for simulation and arduino opc server so let me connect with my arduino opc da server so i am connected you can see here the logs now i'll add some tags like temperature and humidity so i have arduino serial zero humidity here and arduino serial zero temperature here now i'll add this tag okay so you can see here our arduino is publishing data to our opc da server serially and our opc da is uh, populating that data to any opc da client which is connect to our arduino opc da server so you can see the values here for humidity it is 45 and for temperature it is 28 and it is updating constantly okay so as you can see here our values are updating constantly so this is how you can transfer your dht11 sensor value from your arduino to arduino opc da server and from your opc da server it will be visible to all your opc da client as per this diagram so let me minimize this so our arduino will publish the data to our arduino opc da server and from our arduino opc da server whoever the client connect with it it will populate that data to that client so as you can see here our values are still updating you can see the timestamp so timestamp is freeze because our last value was 45 and it didn't got changed so let me blow some air and then after we will see it again that value is changing or not so i am blowing some air so sorry for this one So as you can see here our humidity value got changed but our temperature didn't change so a temperature is also got changed so this is how uh, if your sensor values got changed you will get those results here and also you can see the updated timestamp here as well 
so this is how you can connect your any sensor with your arduino and you can uh, use your arduino for industrial application okay so i hope everything is clear about this video and if you have any doubt any question or any concern you can ask me in the comment section you can ask me on telegram instagram or you can also send a mail to me and if you want a code then code will be in the description of this video as well as all the software link are also in the description of this video so we will meet you in the next video till then take care goodbye and thank you